It feels great. So it's a proud, uh, a proud moment for the news division. Uh, we're told it's unprecedented that that nobody has won uh, the overall excellent award for for television and for radio two years running. So, uh, so we feel very proud. We had a. Uh, we had a meeting uh, in the newsroom, and you can you can see on the faces of everyone that works at ABC News, they, they they feel proud, they're excited about it. And what were some of the more memorable stories that you covered, at least memorable stories for you that you covered in the past year? Well, there have been a, there have been a lot. There have been a lot. I think you know one of the most memorable things uh, that we did was seeing our medical editor, Rich Besser, on the streets of Liberia, um, live streaming from the streets of Liberia during the Ebola crisis. Um, and it all goes to show that we, you know, we can tell these stories in, in all kinds of different ways now. It's very exciting. But the, wor the world has been an interesting place over the last year. Um, I know RTDNA, they said that they were honoring UBC Business News because of how creative all of your newscasts are. Um, do you try to keep it up to date and creative as possible? Like, how do you do that? Do you stay on top of things? We do. I mean, we were, really, we were pleased to hear them, hear them talk about our storytelling. Because um, it's, it's something we value, we value very deeply uh, how we tell stories and how we uh, do our journalism in the best possible ways and tell stories in, in lots of new and interesting ways. So, you know, we've just started. We are uh, we just launched uh, a virtual reality uh, as 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 our, as our latest attempt. You know, we, we we've told uh, one in Syria. We're about to do one from the from the streets of Pyongyang. Um, it's exciting. Um, and we love, you know, we love finding new ways to tell stories um, and new ways to reach our audience. Um, these are these are very these are very interesting times in our business. Um, do you have any advice for any young journalists who are turning into the field, especially with the business changing so often? Well, I mean, you know, this is a, this is an exciting time. You know, for for any young person, all you need one of these, and you're off. You know, you can go. You can you can. Uh, you can get out in the field. You can you can do video journalism. You know, ten years ago, you needed a you needed a truck. You needed engineers. You know, you needed vast teams of people to uh, to do television journalism. Now you now you can you can be periscoping. All you've got to do is get your camera out. Really exciting. Get out there and go for it. <laughs>